It's scary here. Drops back, looking for the end zone. No one's there. He's running out wide, trying to make his first. He's gonna go somewhere. Five in the middle. He slips down in the end zone. Intercepted. It's over. It's done. Wilton on their feet. Interception. Number eight, Sean Wiseman. It's zero. It's over. Wilton win. Wilton win the football game. Football is a sport loved by millions. But in a town with just under 20,000 people, it's more than that. From the legends to the current players what do you say? to the future varsity stars, Wilton football is much more than just a team. I've been coaching here almost 40 years now. That's a long time. Um, I started out as assistant coach with uh, Coach Fugitani when he was head football coach. And I coached with him for um, upwards of 20, 25 years. And then when he retired, I became the head football coach. And I was head football coach for almost 10 years. Um, and during that time, that was one of the best experiences I've ever had here at Wilton High School. Um, I can't tell you, uh, we had a good football team, we had a good football program, I had great assistant coaches, but the biggest things I had, I had kids who wanted to win in the worst way, um, and they took tremendous pride in, in the Wilton tradition. Being part of the Wilton coaching staff, no matter what you coached, what sport was, was something very, very special. There's just so much pride and tradition in the sports here at Wilton High, especially football. I mean, there was there was packed houses at those games every Friday and Saturday afternoon, and it was just something very, very special for me um, to be the head coach. And it was an honor to be the head coach for the 10 years that I was head coach. My experience with the Wilton community, I think, uh, has been very inviting. Uh, I think. You know, I've attended uh, a few, I've, I've actually been a guest speaker at the Kiwanis uh, Club. Um, you know, I've been invited to speak to a lot of youth groups um, this fall. Um, but really just sort of getting out who I am and my message. Um, you know, spoke to the Wilton Chamber of Commerce and uh, really just kind of knowing who I am, you know, what my goals are, you know, what my plan is for the future for Wilton Athletics. Wilton football, what it means to me. Um, well, I will tell you, it's it's a year-long commitment. Um, you know, during the season, it's four months of every single day, whether it's practice, uh, watching film, but also in the off-season, whether it's being in the weight room, making sure our, our guys are doing the right thing in school, academically. Um, so it's turned into a basically a full-time job, uh, which is one that I love. Um, but it is more than just the football season. It's, it's, it's 12 months. You know, I, I see some of the kids who've graduated come back um, now as sophomores and juniors in college. Um, some of them still playing football in college. Um, you know, I consider them family. Uh, you know, we talk a lot about family um, with Wilton football. Um, and I, I, I firmly believe that, you know, when you play football, it's such a, it's such a tough sport and it's a, a, a grinding sport. Um, and when you spend that much time with someone, you become your family. Um, I know I spend more time with my football guys than I do with my wife. So, um, you know, family is important. And I think, um, I, I think one of the greatest things about Wilton football is the bond that we've all created. And uh, when the kids come back, you know, they say how much they miss it, uh, which is great to hear. And, uh, you know, it's a bond between kids. It's a bond between my coaching staff. Um, and I think, you know, we've come, we've come a ways. You know, Wilton, um, I, my goal has always been never be worse than 500. And we haven't so far, and we've had some pretty good seasons. And um, I think that reflects mainly on kids. Um, I think it also reflects on the off-season preparation um, and our coaches. So uh, very pleased with the way things are going right now for Wilton football. Um, so the numbers are up. Um, I think the town, I think the community, I think the administration realize that you know football is important. And uh, I, I think we've gotten the program to where I, I like it to be. Um, but now we have to get even better. Um, we're not going to go back. We're only going to go forward. And I think that the the program itself, the kids involved realize it and realize what kind of commitment it takes. And uh, we're going to keep striving. Uh, we're going to strive every year to be state champions. And uh, listen, I think we're going to get there within the next couple of years. And um, as I said, the main thing is we keep growing. We don't want to stand still. We want to keep getting better each year. 
And the kids know our motto is, you know, bigger, faster, stronger every day. So that's what we do.